And NBC Montana's investigative reporter Bowen West reached out to U.S. representatives Matt Rosendale and Ryan Zinke to get their reactions on the proposed bipartisan border bill. On Sunday, after a long wait, the 370-page document was released of a contentious border bill. I reached out to Montana's U.S. representatives to get their thoughts on the bill. Gotten the chance to read through the border bill yet? You know I have, and I just got off the plane from Montana, and I can tell you it's a non-starter. Let me begin by saying the President of the United States has the authority to shut down the border, in part, in whole. And President Biden has chosen not to. U.S. Representative Zinke said this is more of an immigration bill than it is a border bill. He said that it would allow 5,000 immigrants in per day. Oklahoma Republican Senator James Lankford, one of the bill's sponsor, said on Twitter that the bill is not designed to let 5,000 people in, but designed to close the border and turn 5,000 people away. U.S. Representative Matt Rosendell also opposed the proposed bill, saying that too much money was going in support of Ukraine and saying that this is an indicator that there needs to be new leadership in the United States Senate. I don't believe that this, that this legislation could have been written worse if the cartels themselves had have taken pen to, to paper and drafted it. I'll continue following this story, so make sure to tune in on air and online for the latest. And you can visit our homepage at NBCMontana.com to watch my extended interviews with Zinke and Rosendale. Reporting in studio, Bowen West, NBC Montana.